Welcome back. Today we're comparing two popular automation tools for Windows, TinyTask and AutoHotKey. Both let you automate repetitive tasks, but they work in very different ways. Let's start with TinyTask. This tool is extremely lightweight and simple to use. It records your mouse clicks and keyboard presses, then plays them back exactly as you did them. If you want to repeat the same action again and again, like clicking a button or opening a program, TinyTask makes it easy. No coding required. Just record, save, and run. Now, let's look at AutoHotKey. Unlike TinyTask, AutoHotKey is a scripting language. It requires a little more learning, but it's far more powerful. With AutoHotKey, you can create custom hotkeys, automate complex workflows, remap your keyboard, or even write full scripts that interact with software. If you're comfortable writing a few lines of code, the possibilities are almost endless. When it comes to ease of use, TinyTask wins. It's perfect for beginners who just want quick automation without learning scripts. But in terms of power and flexibility, AutoHotKey takes the crown. It can handle advanced automations that TinyTask simply can't do. In terms of performance, both run smoothly and use very little system resources. TinyTask is minimal and fast, while AutoHotKey can run in the background and handle multiple scripts at once. So which one is better? Choose TinyTask if you want something extremely simple, lightweight, and beginner-friendly. Choose AutoHotKey if you need serious automation power and are willing to learn a bit of scripting. In short, TinyTask is for simplicity. AutoHotKey is for flexibility. Which one do you prefer for your workflow? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and hit the bell for more tutorials.